He said, that's your mic over there. That, that, that one over there. Take that shit. What up, everybody? What's good? Okay. All right. Let me tell y'all something, man. Let me tell y'all something. I wrote a set tonight for y'all. I promise you. I swear to God, I wrote a set to you for you guys. But since I've been sitting here, I didn't came up with a whole bunch of new shit. All right? Look, he already know. He's smiling. You know where I'm going, my nigga. You know where I'm going. Check it out. And I know I look like a motherfucker that just came home and found his wife cheating. I know. Don't worry about the tie. Fresh off of work. Don't get it twisted, all right? I got a vent to you motherfuckers, all right? So first off, I want to dedicate a little bit of time for some of the people that came up before me. Can we clap that shit up? Please, please, please. All right, that's enough, that's enough. I ain't got that much goddamn time, all right? First off, the first comedian, goddamn, you had us. You had us. Kevin Bacon, you had us. But as soon as Plantation came out, oh, everybody was looking like this motherfucker, right? God damn. You had us Plantation. That, that was Coolio. Where'd Coolio go? Where'd he go? Coolio. Ah, oh, well, he had us until he started saying, nigga, come on. Am I wrong? Seriously? Seriously, nobody felt that touch on the heart? So, 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 nigga, oh! Every time he said, oh! I was feeling it. The beat, everything was great. So, let me move on past that. I'm sorry. I just had to get that out. Now, my name is Jay Payton, obviously a comedian. I'm a little fucked up. Got my adios. It is what it is. Now, I seen some of y'all faces drop when I didn't say James Harden. You motherfucker, I saw your face. I saw it. It's just the, it's just the beard, my nigga. All right? Some people ain't got an imagination. They see the beard and they like, oh, and then they see the rest of the face and they're like, ah. Oh. I take you through emotions with this shit. You feel me? Everybody say I look like James Harden, even at work. It's some bullshit. Motherfucker tell me. James Hart, you know how you look like? Motherfuckers come up to me like they about to tell me a deep, dark secret type shit. Like, hey, bro, hey, 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 come here, come here, come here, come here. They be looking around. Hey, come here. What's up, man? Hey, let me tell you something, my nigga. They look around. You know who you look like? I go along with it. I go along with it. Who? Who I look like? <laughs> you ain't going to believe this shit. James Harden. <laughs> I'm like, oh, he, oh, really? Oh, I never heard that shit before. Hey, you want me to Google it? I do it right now. And it's and it's crazy. Like, people get mad at me for not being the motherfucker. Like, hey, man, you know you ain't James Harden, right? I ain't never said I. I got into an argument with this chick. Thank you, James Harden. This shit. I never said that. I don't want to be that man. You, you, you just grow a beard, and now you the shit. I, I like the way it looks because I got a little chin, all right? I don't like walking around with a little ass chin. People think they can sock me out type shit. No, I'm not having it. I look more manly. Can I, right? I mean, come on, tell me. Motherfucker's crazy, man. This shit weird. I love the talent in this motherfucker, but man, some of you niggas gotta, gotta change the shit. Just a little bit, just a little bit. I mean, I'm just one man. This is my opinion. Change the shit just a little bit. My host dude, you were fucking awesome, man. I'm sorry if I can't cuss, I'm sorry. But you were awesome, man. And even if you did say nigga, it slipped in there with nobody noticing. Like, no, 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 nigga. But then when they said some shit, uh, nigga. And there was, <laughs> Even the white dude at the bar, he was like, oh, fuck. Don't fucking look at me. Oh, shit. He said it again. Fuck. This motherfucker right here. It's no joke, man. 
Back to the James Harden shit, I'm kind of all over the place. I'm one of them comedians that's just like, I get my adios and I go in. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, the James Harden shit is fucking up my life. Motherfuckers at work talking about James Harden, James Harden. Like, I never heard this shit before. So one day I was like, fuck it, I'm going to play along with the shit. So motherfucker was like, Harden. So I, I did one of these. I did one of these. Right? Guess what this motherfucker say? Wrong hand. I'm like, oh, shit. I can't even, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's not even fun. It's not even fun no more. I didn't always want to do comedy, though. That was not my first pick. I thought I was going to be a basketball player because I had braids. Everybody thought I was going to be like Iverson and shit like that. And just to let y'all know, I meant to say this shit beforehand. I was born in 87. So y'all can kind of get a general, you know what I'm saying, NWA. Uh, like, you know what I'm saying? I came up, you know, and I, and I went the one minute, okay, for sure, 90s and all that shit. So anyway, back to what I was saying, I thought I wanted to play basketball before, you know, comedy and shit like that. My mom told me, like, I'm going to put you in the, uh, in the junior Lakers and shit. I had braids. I had these motherfucking shoes that said Peyton on the side. That's my last name. Peyton on the motherfucking side. So I would walk around like this and shit, like, with the side out, with the name out and shit. So I got on this basketball team. Didn't make one shot the whole fucking playoff. Like, not one shot. Not even one accident shot. Like, it was crazy. So I'm running up and down the court, and it's literally like, I'm, I'm sucking. I, it's bad. It's real bad. So I hear this lady all the fucking time, get him off the fucking court. Get him off of there. He's fucking wack. He's missing all the shots. Come to find out at the end of the season, it's my, it's my mom telling, screaming that shit. And she would buy the whole team Gatorade and give me like half a water bottle, half an Aquafina with the lipstick on the, on the rim and shit. So I would have to drink that shit. So I don't know, man. It, it, it's ridiculous. Uh, how, many, how many seconds, man? I mean, <laughs> like, it, yeah, he gave me the cut. That's shit. All right, guys, I'm out of here, man. I will be back. Thank you very much for your support. Let me get my adios. Jerry Payton.